everyone is Dylan at Drum Girls again. Uh, as you all know, I love ink, so today I just wanted to do two more ink reviews. Uh, the first one is from a little bit more obscure ink company from South Korea. It is Three Oysters. They make one of my favorite ink bottles ever. It looks just like this. Today the color I'll be covering is navy blue, but the reason I love the ink bottle so much is it has this little divot in the corner that actually allows it to just sit on its side. I love displaying this on my bookcase, uh, just a few of them in a row because it's very aesthetically pleasing. Um, as I said, the color I'm covering today is navy blue, and lo and behold, it is a really dark navy blue color with a really prominent red sheen to it. I'm going to kind of turn it into the light so you can see the sheen a little bit better. Um, the ink is one of my favorites because it is dark enough that it is really, really satisfying but it is still light enough that you can see the navy blue when you're writing. And the sheen in it isn't so uh, overwhelming that, you know, it just over, uh, that it overloads the color of the ink. Um, so I really like, I really, really enjoy using this ink. Uh, it is, does come in a 38 milliliter bottle for only $16. Um, I'll definitely be throwing a link for both the inks I'll be reviewing today down in the description below, as well as the close-ups as usual. Um, three Oyster ink tend to be uh, on the wetter side, just like most South Korean, uh, just like well, the, the two South Korean inks that we carry. Um, and I haven't had any issues with any of my Three Oysters inks, so I'm pretty sure it's safe, I'm pretty good to say that they're safe to use in ink pen. Uh, the other ink that I wanted to cover today is um, an ink that from a very prominent ink pen and ink company, Pelican. Uh, the ink that I'll be covering today from them is the uh, ink of the year from their Edelstein collection, Moonstone. This did come out with a pen this year as well, and I gotta say the color, even though I'm not much of a gray person, uh, it's one of the more interesting grays that I've seen. It is a really, really light gray, but it's definitely on the warm side, and there's a lot, a lot of shading in it as a light gray, plus there seems to be a lot of shading in into a, a yellow undertone, which just makes the ink really, really interesting to look at. And when I was writing with it with a stub nib, I did get all this variation in my writing. Um, the Edelstein inks come in 50 ml bottles for $35, and so both inks are definitely uh, more affordable inks. Um, and both of them are just really, really great to use in any pen. Uh, as, of course, uh, if you like this video, definitely hit the like button, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you want to see more of this video. See you next time. Bye.